this is the modification that I've this is the modification that I've done to the sander after I broke that uh, bearing on the other pillow block. Got a little bit bigger bearing, a little bit wider there. I reuse this one. This is the older one. It's still in good shape. The pillow block and everything on the other one was destroyed. It was just loose and sloppy. It had been eating itself up. I would reuse the shaft, but it's slightly bent. So that um, it's got a slight bow right here. This is where the two bearings were held before the pillow blocks held it. And so it has a slight bow on this end. Very slight, but it's enough that at uh, 7300 RPM it starts to shake pretty good. Or it starts to wobble. Not shake very good, but it gets to be noisy. And then, so those will go down on there. I'll make a, I'll put a little extension tube out here made from this material. little extension tube I'll weld in there and then put an eyelet on there so that I'll have a tie down for my tensioning spring and I'm going to put a second tensioning spring up here so that I can get the right tension at high speed the drive wheel will sit right there so it won't have hardly any uh, shaft sticking out to bend it'll be supported right there the, pu the pulley system will sit right the pulley will sit right here so it won't have any shaft to bend either it should be a lot more solid a lot more steady more durable.